from past experience, this city is well worth a visit. We're in Seville at the Ramon Sanchez Pituan Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's Sevilla, and they face Al Itihad. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Fabinho. Coronado. Well, can they open up the defence here? Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. And this is how Sevilla will line up. In goal, it's Marco Dimitrovic. Marcos Acuna plays with Jesus Navas in the fullback positions. Ivan Rakitic plays alongside Fernando in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. This is the lineup for the visitors today. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the lead striker today is Karim Benzema. Has eyes for goal. A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly, and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Jesus Navas. Loic Bade. Jesus Navas now. Johan Jordan. Might be able to set up the chance. And this is Navas. Now with Suso. A good and fair challenge. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Who can he pick out? Benzema. Here's Fabinho. Well, passing moves like this will build confidence. Have no interest in losing possession. No let up here. Conte. No way through. Johan Jordan. Jesus Navas. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Yusuf and Nesiri. Well, nicely cut out. And a lot to like about this attack. Coronado Fabinho plenty of support here that is how to keep it out of the net Marcos Acuna Ivan Rakitic Great opportunity, and a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic, that's a dynamic strike. So back underway following the equaliser. Jota.
Benzema. Corbelin here, blocking it. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Johan Jordan. Jesus Navas. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Decided to come in from the flank. Spot on with that tackle. Coronado. Conte has it. He's protecting it effectively. What can he do with it now? It's there for him. And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, he has to come up with a game plan. His side is struggling now. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. And so it is. The first half story has been written. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. He's playing with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere and he's taking his goals really well. So back underway here into the second half. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, he's not happy, is he? He just needs to calm himself down here. Oh, nice ball over the top. Dmitrovic. Bade. It's with Marco Dmitrovic. Continues his run. Benzema, it's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space and it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. He knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Torres. Here's Marcos Acuna. It's Torres now. Romarinho. subtlety he's hit the woodwork well he made decent contact with it but he has to score from that range time for a change then
Yusuf and Nesiri. Now with Rakitic. Had a chance to whip it in here. Oh, a fine block. And into the last 30 minutes now. So making the substitution now. Jesus Navas. Here's Jordan. And Nesiri on the offensive. Coronado. Running with the ball confidently. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Loic Bade. Here's Jordan. Well, I think just lost his focus for a second and a throw-in conceded. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Jesus Navas. Goudel Ocampos and that is how to block oh he's lost possession well this has to be their way back into the game the crowd are certainly playing their part let's see about the delivery a decent effort but the keeper read it all the way Well, his reaction says it all. It's just not been their day so far. Well, spot on with that challenge. Just 15 minutes remaining. Oh, great vision. Rakitic. The danger not over. That was going in. <laughs> but he's gone short with it. Lucas Ocampos. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Jota. No space for them here. Benzema. Oh, he's blocked it. And giving the ball away. Conte. A danger here as he runs at them. Chance to cross. Got to get back. Conte. And an astute piece of defending. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And passing it well. Fernando. And the challenge, crisp and clean. Well, the fans are going mad here. They think that was a penalty. And the substitution will occur now. Gonzalo Montiel. Bade. We will have three minutes of additional time at the end here. 
And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? In behind for him to chase. Can he finish here? Vigorous defending. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. Well, here we can see it again. And it starts with the ball over the top. Perfectly weighted. And Benzema made the finish look so easy. As he so often does. It's a lovely goal. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Oh, oh dear, Derek, that was a worrying display. They were completely outplayed in almost every department. The coach has got a lot of work to do before the next game. And the shining light for his side, Karim Benzema. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.